about this video, before this intro is over, I'll have a gigantic drop party on RuneScape in a few weeks and I'll post on Facebook and Twitter and I'll invite everyone, we'll fill the entire server and we'll fuck shit up! Hey guys, what's going on? My name is Max Mofo. Uh, this is mail time, and if you would like to send me mail, you can send it to this address. This is my PO box. Every single bit of mail that I send to this address will eventually be shown on the show. Anyway, guys, I've had this uh, long one for a while, and just before we get into anything else, I kind of just want to open this up and see what the fuck is inside of it. So I, I know it's not going to be a piano or anything. Uh, obviously, it's a poster of some kind. Oh my! <laughs> Look, check this out. It's a Rooney poster. <laughs> Why did I not see this coming? Oh my god. It's a giant Rooney poster. And I think I have it upside down there. There you go, look. <laughs> so uh, anyway guys, I've had a few changes that I think I want to make to Mail Time. You know I didn't post last week. Um, and this one, this video actually is also late. I've been behind on uh, quite a few videos across all of my channels lately. I did get very sick at one point. Which you know, it's kind of one of those things that just kind of jumps out and smacks you. And uh, I haven't been sick for a very, very long time. So it hit me pretty hard for a few days. But we're back on track, and I'm going to change a few things about mail time. As you know, Smosh and a lot of other people who do open mail kind of just open mail willy-nilly how they want to. They kind of just pick anything out which they want to, which I'm starting to think might be a better formula because a lot of you guys are complaining that, oh, I don't want to send anything anyway. Like, oh, I really want to send something, but you won't open it for a long time since he's opening really old mail. And on top of that, there's a lot of people that don't even watch my show anymore that I know have sent me mail and I've opened and they don't really watch or give a fuck about it anymore. Anyway, so instead of trying to label all my bags of mail and stuff that I have which is getting very hard anyway it's kind of all mixed up because I'm in a very small room I'm trying to go through the process of moving house at the moment which is becoming very difficult so hopefully in a few months I can actually sort that out properly but I'd like to give you guys you know a bit of inside information so you kind of know what's going on but yeah so what I'm gonna do what I think I should do is kind of just take bits of mail randomly like just open it randomly everything will should eventually be open anyway I'm not gonna stop doing it and I open so much more mail than quite a lot of other people on YouTube and I don't, you know, I'm not biased, I'm not like, oh, I, I won't open letters because, you know, I think Shane Dawson gets uh, quite a lot of shit because he, he tends to just open packages kind of, and then recently a lot of people were like, you know, fuck you, please open some of our letters, so you open a few letters. But, you know, I try to do everything in a way that you guys find interesting, I try to go through everything, I'll show everything on air at least, you know, once, like, even if it's a letter and it's just a letter, I will show it for a bit of time, we'll try to read something interesting about it, you know. And this process is making me go through lots of different things but I still have a lot to open but I think this is a better idea to kind of just open stuff willy-nilly so if you guys send me something it might get open in quite a long time it might get open straight away it's random but I'm not biased about it I am open a shitload of letters every mail time like a lot of letters and then a few packages and obviously one or two boxes if of course I got lots more boxes or packages then I would open lots more boxes and packages but I kind of need to save them for start and end of the mail show. So a lot of you guys are probably going to agree with this and a lot of you guys probably won't agree with this but basically what I'm saying is you guys can send mail and it, it might get opened sooner than you think but it might take longer. And a few other suggestions uh, brought up the, the fact that I said I was going to open some during uh, vlogs uh, and I should do that also. I'm going to open just a few, you know, while I do my vlogs and I do, need to do more vlogs as well. So while I'm doing vlogs, I'll just kind of maybe have some letters on the go when I'm going somewhere and kind of just open them on camera. Put a few of those in there, a few packages and that just to kind of get on top of mail as well. And lastly, before we start, also my birthday mail, which was the red packages. We do have a few red letters and packages. Uh, that's not until August. So on August, as I said, I'm going to have a birthday special where I open absolutely everything that's wrapped or coloured in red. And without further ado, me and the Rooney poster and the DJ Arnie glasses and his five cent pieces, let's open up the next bit of mail. So as you can see with all this mail, I'm going to take a random bit and we're going to open it. And that's how the process is going to be going. That's, I worded that terribly. We're just going to go through mail and mail and mail, randomly, completely randomly. And that's how it's going to go. And yes guys, I know I'm getting a bit of a disgusting kind of neck beard and my hair's getting long and I need to cut it, I need to sort it out, I need to get my life on track. Let's open, let's open up this box first, well secondly to the Rooney poster. Okay, so this one, I, oh man, we've got a giant box of Pokemon cards, I'm not sure what's real or fake in here, but let's take a look. So first of all, the letter says, Hey Max Mofa, my YouTube name is Lee Krushelniski, and my bro's name is Nolan Mast 13 I'm giving my whole Pokemon card set, treat them well. I don't know if they're fake. If they are, make a dress or something. Goodbye. I like the fact that you think that if I was going to make something out of them, it would be a dress. And I just went through all 256 of these cards and they are all real. We also have a nice little stack of incredibly 
sexy looking shinies, hollows, reverses there. And this is the prime. This is the biggest bad boy out of all of them, which is an Entei Gold Star. A Gold Star is essentially a shiny Pokemon, as in a different colored Pokemon in the anime or the, you know, the games. There's a long history of different ways that they decided they would make them officially shiny Pokemon in the card game. But from this point onwards, they started making them, they put this little gold star next to the name. So this is an incredibly collectible card. Thank you very much. Thank you for all these Pokemon cards and a bunch of this pink coin in here as well, which would go perfectly with my Pokemon dress. Next, 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 next! Max Rifo! Max Rifo! Again! So this one's from Zeke, and Zeke has drawn a picture of two dicks jizzing towards each other, colliding in the middle and dribbling down the page. And the letter says, Dear Max, I love your vids. Most of all, I love your prank vids. Thank you, Zeke. Thanks for the drawing of the two dicks colliding. But if I wanted a drawing of that, I would have got a professional illustrator and photographer to stand next to each other outside your window. Next! It's still on the wall. Hey Max, the Pronus again, and we've got this, it looks like it's supposed to be a marble, but it's made of rubber, and we've also got this little Hello Kitty bag, which is signed as this, ta -da -ta -da. remember these? These really old fucking iPods. And if we turn the screen on, we can see this is, this is like a picture of Shrek or something. The screen's broken with this giant black and green pixel mess. Next! Dear Max Mofo, I've sent you a little fan art. Let's scope it out. Is this the fan art? This $5, guys, come on. Don't send me money, really. All right, we've got this drawing here from Mono Screams. We've got a picture over here and a big green telephone. And this one was from Oscar. This next one is purple. That's a good color for a dress. To Max, I have not had time to send anything, but now have. I love your videos, and unfortunately, I missed you in Sydney. Anyways, enjoy. We've got the little Pokemon down there. We've got a uh, Agamon, Plant Dude, and a uh, Beyblade. Some of my uh, favorite starters from Eliza. So uh, thank you for the buckle gun drawing there, Eliza. Next. Fucking hell, Jesus. Fucking God. This is not entertaining waiting for this to go off if it never, if we, you're supposed to sit here for this long. We also have this little car in here. That's kind of cool. This next one's from Kyle Luxford. I'm Batman. We got some drawings of poker guy dudes. And this letter that says I have sent fake Pokemon cards and indeed we have three fake Pokemon cards. Thanks, Kyle. Best. This one has a pink flower in it. That would um go good with my dress. Hey Max, I made a pick for you. I hope you like it. Six. And I'm assuming this one's from Canada because we've got some Canadian money and this is five dollars. It better not be worth five dollars in my country. You just, you do <laughs> Let's say you're a child and you get pocket money. You don't have to go, oh, maybe Max would want my money. I should send him my money. If you want to send me like um, a note or something that's worth like 0.1 cents or you know something like that, that's fine. Or I guess if you have a lot of money and you want to send me something that's a Canadian note or something to add to my collection of foreign money, that's fine too. And I hate going into this kind of lecture mode every time someone wants, every time someone sends me money, but I just, I kind of feel bad if I'm taking money from you, you know, especially if it's actually a decent amount of money to you personally. How about you send me a drawing of money? A lot of people do that as well. And this says, oh shit, no, oh fuck. I think I just opened up something that was supposed to be for my birthday. The card was pink. You send a pink envelope. It wasn't red enough for me to trigger my bra. Oh, fuck. See, this, this is, it's just, oh no, this, it's kind of, it's, it's more pink. Okay, I'll try not to open up any more birthday stuff because I don't have nothing to open for my birthday. Wish you the best and love from Canada. But it's me kind of holding milk in like an adventure style kind of picture. I'm wearing my fin hat. And I guess if you want this on the wall specifically, I'll put it on the wall. It is definitely small enough to fit. So all the way to Canada, thank you very much for this birthday card, Aaron. I'm sorry I opened it prematurely. We've also got some Canadian coins in there. And I think the last time I got a $5 note, a Canadian $5 note, I, I could not stop laughing at the fact that there's actually hockey on the money, which... <laughs> I don't, know, I don't know why I find that so funny. All right, moving on. Let's try not to open anything that's red or pinkish, which is, is this red or pinkish? The back is black. I, see, I don't know. This, where's the line? I mean, I know I specifically said things like this will still get open because that's like a default Australia post parcel, which means red it was probably a terrible color for me to pick. But I guess anything that's red or pink, completely wrapped or colored, I won't open until August. Next. Dear Max, my, phone, my name is Alec Bell and I think you're awesome. I am 14 years old 
Jordan, I live in South Carolina in the USA. I did not know what to get you, so I got you a few Pokemon cards. I sent you a Max Mofo picture, which I don't know where it is. Oh, oh, you guys always say you sent something and I can't find it. There's absolutely no picture in here. But this one is from Alec, and Alec has attached some Pokemon cards. If you're 14 years old, you obviously had, um, or have a big brother, or maybe you bought this or something, because this is a fossil set version of Aerodactyl, and it is indeed the Japanese one as well, so that's quite old. And attached also is this legit excellent Legends card. And is this thing getting annoying yet? It's never going to go off, honestly. It's not, it's just an eyesore. Next! Do is incest. I fucking knew it. Next! Look out your window! Okay, it's pot plant, a fence, mate. Next door neighbors? Next! Oh, Charmander! It's very colorful, actually. I do like that a lot. Alright, guys, this one's from Sammy B, and Sammy B says you're a babe, and it took fucking forever to draw that Charmander, so you better appreciate it. I said it was good, okay? Next! Alright, this one is from Victor, and Victor says Josh is a gay, midget, necrophile, pedophile guy. Next! Max 25! Ho oh, ho! Now that is a wolf! Check out that beast! So this one's from Anime Lord, and Anime Lord wants a shout out to Sophie and Bryce! You watch yourself, Bryce. Next! Dear Max Mofo, this letter contains fingerless gloves, 500 Indonesian rupiah, and a thing with rocks in it. Which is it's kind of cool, weird, it's cool, it's like a little vial with tiny rocks. I kind of feel like these gloves with this hair and these glasses and this black shirt make me look like I just want to stab myself in the soul. You're just a, you're a conformist. You're fucking, you're a sheep, man. Now I gotta go home and upload my poetry to Tumblr. Yeah. From Emily. Ta-da. This next one is from Josh. You know your place, son. You know your place. Oh, mama, that's a lot of Pokemon cards. We're getting a lot of Pokemon cards this episode. Hey, Max, it's Josh here from the Gold Coast. This is my first time writing to a YouTuber, and Josh has attached 180 plus Pokemon cards, all which are real there. Thank you very much for that, Josh. And Josh says that his favorite prank call is the Pokemon Tourette's. Max! <laughs> what the fuck is that? It looks like a rainbow, a disabled rainbow dash. I'm not trying to offend anyone, but honestly, check out that <laughs> Look at its legs. Okay, this one's from Delany, and Delany has sent in this ring and a bunch of drawings that she wants me to show. And of course, this is everyone's favorite. It's the blue bangle. Max Mofo and the blue bangle show. Honestly, it doesn't fit. I can't put that on. Next! All right, we have a Minecraft Finn with a mustache shirt, a Pikachu tail, shitting out a rainbow. Doesn't get much weirder than this. This thing is just, I seriously, I s fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. P.S. Next time you assassinate a letter, please open it very slowly. Next. Shit ton of Yu-Gi-Oh cards, some are fake, some are real. We also have two tea bags and a letter that says, Dear Max Mofo, my name is Anna and I don't have a YouTube channel. I fucking love your vids. I was just about to open this one and I realized this is probably colored red for my birthday, so I'm gonna open up this one instead. Next. Pokemon Tarzo is a shit ton of them. You remember these guys, little reflective po Oh, we've got some Digimon ones in there as well. Um, I've got a pretty much, I think I have the entire set of those in the book that someone sent me. Um, but you guys do keep sending me these as well. Max, you're such a dog. My letter from two years ago hasn't been, oh, fuck off. Stop talking shit. Brandon is gay. Max! Oddish, gloom, vile plume. He's looking very depressed. This is from Danielle, and Danielle says, Your videos bring a great break into my busy work schedule. Your prank calls really make me smile, and I have even got my boyfriend Sam into your calls, even though he doesn't usually like them. Thank you so much, Sam. That really fucking makes my day. Yes! Oh, we have a wallet. It's just literally a wallet. That's just, yes. Perhaps there is a letter in this wallet. No, it's literally an empty wallet. Supposed to taunt me or something. How about I put my Canadian money in it? What are you going to do then? Next. All right, boys, we've got some, uh, we've got some footy cards here. They've got, uh, they've got fucking dicks drawn on every one of them. As, I'm assuming it's calling them dickheads. And <laughs> then there is this single Pokemon card of Blastoise. Thank you very much. Next. 
To Maxi, my name is Kimberly. I'm from Victoria, mate. And Kimmy has sent in <laughs> a car wash token. I'm not being, I'm, I'm not clowning around. It's a car wash token. All right, this next one I was about to open. This is not red. Honest to fucking God, this isn't even close to red. This is orange. And I was like, okay, no one, this, this is obviously not to do with my birthday. Then on the back it says, happy birthday. Come on, guys. Red. Yes. We got a little fat Pikachu in there. And this one's from Jackson, and he says Josh is fucking gay. Next! Hey Max, it's Pronus again, and Pronus has sent in some Yu-Gi-Oh cards, most of which I believe are fake, but thank you again, Pronus. Next! Okay, this one's from Alex, and it says that him and his brother have been watching my videos for quite a long time, and we've got a, a drawing there of um, your mother holding up a, a crow. Next! Dear Max, you are funny. My name is Matty. I didn't know what to send, so here are some used iTunes cards. Let's take a look. Oh, we've, oh, we've also got... A, no, come on. Here's the used iTunes cards, and I thought this was like a $1 American note, but we've got a $5 American note, a $1 American note, a $1 American note. That's... We've got a $5 Canadian, a $5 American, and a $5 Australian today. <laughs> okay, thank you very much, Matty. And thank you for keeping the tradition alive with the used iTunes cards. Next! Next! <laughs> Max my phone! Peter and Jake! And Domo! I am Good Singer! Hi, our names are Max, Nick, and Seb. We are sending this letter to say that we are your biggest fans. Join a gym then. <laughs> Especially you, Sebastian. Look at that neck. Next, Drew is gay. We've got quite the blank is gay thing going on today as well. To Max, my name is Anna and I'm 19. I live in Bunbury. This is my first time sending mail. Your videos always make me laugh. I've been watching them for over a year. My favorite one is Pokemon Haunting. I would send you Pokemon cards, but I love them too much. But Anna has sent in these adorable Pokemon drawings. Absolutely fantastic. We've got a uh, little Pokemon hugging onto Pokeballs. Best. Vanguard cards, giving me early memories of the first mail show. We've also got some very old looking coins. Put those aside over there to put in my butthole later. Let's read the letter. Hey Max, it's Rhyme Noise Pin again, sending you, this is the first guy, this is the guy that sent those originally. It's Rhyme Noise Pin sending you some more Vanguard cards and a new drawing, since my old one got covered up. Sadly didn't end up going to your Melbourne meetup because I was sick anyway. Enjoy and hopefully you open this soon. Amazing line work there to be honest. It's like a yin and yang. Chaotic cards? What is this? I have absolutely never heard of chaotic cards. I have, however, heard of these. We've got a drawing of a shark with a big fat block for a head. Kane is heterosexual. A lot of messages today. Hey Max, I sent you a few of my weaker Pokemon and some of my chaotic cards. In brackets, I don't know much about them. Either do I. I'm probably going to go Google them after this. We've got a bunch of mainly fake Pokemon and Yu-Gi-Oh cards with a, a few real ones in there and a big letter or drawing that says, Dear Max Mofo, you poo. Max, here I have a picture of a Mudkip wearing a creeper sweater. Sup, Max, the man of fun, your video is hilarious. I just wanted to show my appreciation and I drew your picture of a Mudkip. See ya from Justus. Next letter. Dragon Ball Z Tarzos. More Dragon Ball Z Tarzos. My favorite prank is Neopets gambling bullshit. I... No. Stop being a tricker! From Merc. Merc the tricky pranks the tricker guy. Joker man. Max! Dear Max, hello you funny fuck. Thank you for always cheering me up when I need it, you king pisser. Little Max Mofo drawing and a bunch of Pokemon cards in here. These are obviously from the actual very new set because we have a Team Plasma Scammery in there. And of course everyone's favourite, an AFL card. <laughs> king pisser! <laughs> To Max Mofo, I like your videos, especially mail time, motherfucker. Can you please put my drawing up on your wall? I have been trying for ages. Next! Oh, we got an ice cream. We got a little rubber ice cream in there. Dear Max Mofo, your videos are really funny and help cheer me up when my dad leaves for weeks on business. Love Harper, and Harper has drawn a picture of a narwhal, which is scientifically incorrect, which has been popularized like a lot lately by cartoons and things like that because this narwhal down here as you can see has a horn on its head and there's its mouth when really the horn on a narwhal said I believe goes through their upper lip because it's actually one of their teeth I think, I think that's how it goes, something like that. Next! Next! Oh yeah, Game Boy Color Games, Yu-Gi-Oh! Game Boy Color Game. Don't know how long you've been holding on to this and you didn't need to send it to me, but thank you very much. I will put it in my collection of Game Boy Games. And who do I have to thank for this marvellous treasure? Ricky! 
Dear Max, my name is Ricky. I'm 17 and I'm from the US. Your videos are hilarious, man. Keep up the good work. I drew you a picture. We've got a little picture in here which says prank time, bitch. I also sent you an old GBC game. Stay funny, subscriber for life. Cheers, Ricky. I hope you truly do say stay a subscriber for life. Stay, stay, stay. He also wants me to say something, but uh, please don't say this as if you're reading it. So he says, tell, okay, hold on. Tell Robert. Robert! 3BH is whack and your grandmother needs to stop sucking so much dick. That sounds so mean. His grandmother's probably a nice woman and you're probably just really mean. Next! All I can picture is Robert's grandma smoking some big logs. We got a Max Mofo wearing a Pikachu onesie, which is literally what I am wearing right now. I am so predictable, or maybe just incredibly lazy and disgusting. Max Mofo! Dear Max, how's it going? I'm going pretty well, thank you. My name is Emily. I'm going well, Emily. Thank you very much. I'm a new subscriber. I also live in Perth, which is pretty unfortunate because Perth is so boring. You're saying me living here doesn't spice it up for you at all? This next one, literally, I'm not joking, says, from the servants of Jesus and Mary, which I'm assuming it's going to be some kind of spam mail about Jesus. Uh, let's see. All right, pictures of Jesus, some Bible quotes, a lot of Bible quotes. Okay, a shit lot of Bible quotes. Okay, and they've sent me like this thing in a reverse envelope in here, and I'm supposed to fill this out and send them money. Check or money order, charge my credit card. I am, I guess it, it goes to Jesus. You know, Jesus, he, Jesus always needs new robes, and I'm sure he could, you know, go for a trim of that beard at the barber, just like me. Or maybe I could actually grow it out and become Jesus. Then I could send myself money and become rich. It's a fucking perfect plan. Who am I kidding? My uh, scraggly neck beard is pathetic. All right, guys, so this one's from Skywing7, and Sky says that the letter is quite long, so I can do, uh, you know, too long, didn't read version if I go to the back. But, I, I, you know, I will read the whole thing, but just for this video, I do want to kind of highlight some bits and pieces in here for you guys. Okay, Sky says, I went to high school at an art magnet school for drawing, and while I do love art, the classes somehow burnt me out. When I started watching your videos, I decided to give it one more try, and while they are far from the best I've done, they were the first things in months. All right, so anyway, Skywing7 is definitely the Deviant Art account. It might be a YouTube username as well. I'm not 100% sure right now, but these are some drawings from the account. We've got a little Max Pikachu there and a little Max Raichu there. And if you do want, these are very, very well done. And if you do want more of these, uh, these are definitely drawn by the actual user. You can go to the Deviant Art account. Scope it out. Maybe actually go do that and say, you know, Max Mofo sent you or something. All right, guys, so that brings us to the final bit of mail for this episode. Try not to poke my eye out there. This gigantic package. Let's hope it's not some kind of um, mail that isn't from fans. Hopefully it actually is something here. We've got this uh, big envelope on the outside. I'm not sure if that has anything in it. Nope. Here we go. Oh, shit. Wow. We've got another one of these. I'm not sure if it's from the same person. A very old case. Probably full of Pokemon cards. And this very old looking camera. I'm not sure if it works. Dear Max Mofo, my name is Sean Marino and I love your videos. I've been watching for about nine months now and I have watched almost all of your videos. Inside the box is a binder full of old Pokemon cards that are probably all fake, an old crappy camera, and some old Apple headphones that are broken. P.S. My friend Jacob sent you the Pikachu drawing a month ago. Okay, I, I remember that Pikachu drawing a month ago. And let's take a look in here. We have a bunch of old Pokemon cards in one of these very old books. And at the back, we have um, these other ones, which are like the, the bio cards, which I think is the exact two lots of things that someone sent in before when they sent these in. Maybe you were the one that sent... I, I don't know. But anyway, the final thing that we have in here, uh, you know, this episode, every single person's been sending something and it's saying blank is blank or blank is gay. Blank is gay. It's probably a fucking a record for the most different people sending his sign saying someone is gay. And I, I promise you, I didn't know this. This last thing that I opened, which was this package at the end, has this sign. This wraps it up so perfectly. Everyone is gay. No more procreation. We're all homosexuals. 
<laughs> and if there's anyone watching this that actually is gay, um, you know, it's it's meant to be lighthearted. It's not my fault that all my fans send me letters that say so and so is gay, so and so is gay, so and so is gay. I obviously have no problem with actual homosexual people, and I guess that is pretty much the end of the show. I hope this didn't get too awkward for you. This is my PO box. Every single bit of mail that I sent to this address will eventually be shown on the show. Now it's random, so if you send a letter, it could get shown straight away. Boxes and packages do get shown at the start and finish. My name is Max Mofo. I love each and every one of you, and you're all gay.